every year. Oh, that's what happened. I was screwing around with it here. Um, and then it got so that it was every year. So, it's never happened. Was it time? You know, who knows? But uh, at this point, I really don't know if I want to see it or not. What little bit I'm going to use, I guess it can't hurt if it dissolves. As long as I can get it tight somewhat. Oh, now there's something. Hold on a minute, what's this? Yeah, I think it is. You know what I was thinking? If this would have fit in there, I put a nut through it, a bolt rather, with a nut over here, so as I tighten up the nut, the bolt, the nut will squeeze this, expanding it. And as long as I get it to the point to where I can back it off without dropping the nut, I'll probably put the bolt on this side. That would be better. But, I don't. but now that I'm thinking of that, wait a minute here. But I want something thicker. Work. That's not going to work. Probably too big anyway. Yeah. Ah, what do we got here? Whoa! -ho -ho I need a washer that's going to go on here and that head is perfect for pulling down this is a little too big which is okay actually I think because it'll help push that one down actually it should go a little bigger maybe no that should probably do it okay Now what I'm thinking here is now, as I tighten this up, that should expand inside. 
if it expands enough where I can get this pretty good bite on it, we may be okay. If not, I'll take this with me as well. So this is a 716 size. I do believe that So anyway, the other thing was, I don't know if you've seen it or not or heard about it, uh, apparently, uh, I think I mentioned, I think I mentioned it, uh, in Florida on an island someplace, apparently a, a ship got wrecked or whatever, and one of the uh, Coast Guard auxiliaries, they have a, an air as well. Uh, we have vessels and then we also have air. And, um, they were flying around and apparently they seen this ship that was partially uh, off this island of, a little bit and uh, the guy was flying around the pilot and he seen SOS written now that was basically the story however there was SOS but the guy also had flares and a radio they didn't say too much about that right off the bat, but if you find the article, I think uh, Yahoo has it. The now Tom, the guy I have coffee with on Monday, he's got an interview with the guy because um, he's got to write a story on it for the for the, up here in the Coast Guard, I guess. I don't know if it's a national story he's writing, East Coast story, or division story, but he got assigned to do the story. All right, so we got this, we got this, we got this, we got both of these. Oh, we need the filter. And we need you guys. So let's wander on out here, and then I'll come in and shut everything down. Like all these lights I got running. I also want to finish that. I want to uh, get it up a little bit. Get it up. Yeah. I want to um, lift it so I can get underneath it. I want to uh, drop the deck and check the blades. It's been a while. So. Alright, let's go over here and crawl on the ground. A messy ground at that. Because the last couple spurts went on the ground. There's the filter, but I didn't, well, the wrench, but I didn't use that until the last time because it just kept going. Oh, I didn't bring any cement out with me. Well, let's see what happens. Okay, put these right there within reach. Now, if you look at this, this is clean. There's nothing, no gouges, scratches. There was no reason to be. I'm the only one ever worked on this thing. And this has been done, like I said, since 06, uh, for the first three, four years, twice a year. After that, once a year. However, this last time, it went almost two years. I just had so much shit going on. So, and there, uh, and there it's got that little peach right there I can't see it now because I'm not where I can see it but uh, that'll prevent it from going just so far now the washer or the gasket rather uh, once that seals around the outer perimeter everything else if it did leak would all be inside that so that washer or gasket hello uh, is kind of like keeping everything in place. All right, so now I don't want to put you where you're going to get destroyed because uh, this is a lot of oil here. So let's try it that way. All right, so let's try the little rubber plug first. Let's try that. Let's get that filter out of the way.
Okay, so now let's take this little rubber rubber plug wrench, the 7 16 and let's try to snug this down a little bit. Okay, hello. Uh, I guess I gotta go more by hand here. Uh, okay. Oh, wrong way. Hello. Come on, boys. Wake up. Now, even though we can't see what's going on, I feel it getting tighter. So that plug has got to be doing something. Now the only reason why I'm doing this right now is because I want to get this tight in there. Oh, I didn't feed you? Did you hear? Okay, so let's assume that that's somewhat tight. Now let's see if it's tight enough where if I put the pliers on the end of this. I don't want to go too close because I need room to get it out. Will this tighten that up or is it going to turn on me? Oh, it doesn't look like anything's turning. And what I mean by that is the bolt itself. And more is this other piece turning. So I don't know. I don't know. Hey, you know, you don't know until you try it. That's all I can say. I would have liked to have seen it turn the bolt, you know, the, the stud rather that I'm working with. this off. So let's see, can I pull it off or do I gotta get another nut in there and beat it off? Okay. Whoop, bang you around. See what I mean? See what I mean? Yeah that worked. That worked. That held it down anyway. That's that was a good idea. I'm gonna keep this just like it is. I am. Okay, let's get rid of the seven sixteenths with it. Come on. Ah, fuck it. Leave it here. I'll pick it up after I move the tractor. That's if I ever move the tractor. All right. So this seems to be pretty tight. I wonder if I should try this or not. What do you guys think? Put that in there and tighten this down. Where should I quit? My thing on my head. Come on, get me No flyers? Yeah. Hold this. And it's just like to the point to where. I don't know if I read or not. No. It's a bitch, but I can't go out of the way I need to be. Alright, let's see what happens. No, that didn't work. It still spreads them. Yeah, okay. Alright, so the rubber piece definitely seemed to do something. What? I don't know, but it did something. Alright, let's get the filter, which I put up here, I think. I did. The gasket's all nicey-nicey. This is all nicey-nicey. 
I'm wondering if I should just give it a little snug or not with the wrench. You know, you get kind of shell shocked after a while. I'm going to try it. Watch. I'm not going to do a lot. But pay attention to the piece of dirt right there. There. So, at that point, that's where we're at. Now I gotta get you guys out of there because I'm gonna start filling it. I don't wanna take any chances of it blasting all over the camera. Uh, 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 I can put you there once I start. But let's get something going here. Ah, pieces of wood all over the place. Sure, why not? Uh, I'm not here to clean it right now. So. 